Meanwhile, it has been a deadly year on the roads for motorcyclists. Between January and July, 25 people have died in motorcycle crashes in Maine. According to the Department of Transportation, that's already more than the entire year of 2021, which was 22 deaths. Something that can help drivers learn some defensive skills on a bike is a motorcycle safety course. In Winslow today, 11 new bikers earned their endorsements to ride. New Center Maine's Jack Mulmid was there. This test measures your ability to demonstrate basic motorcycle control skills in low speed maneuvers, braking, swerving, and cornering. Conditions were perfect for a Sunday drive in Winslow. 11 Mainers taking the final part of their safety training before getting their motorcycle license. But first, some skills tests, stopping, turning, and taking your bike up a few gears. For course owner Mike Perkins, these lessons are critical to survival. It is a high risk because inevitably we're, we're smaller on the road, we're not a big vehicle and, they, and people cut out in front of big vehicles, they cut out in front of school buses and they cut out in front of track trail trucks. People get complacent and, they, and, and set your phone away. People, if you're riding a car, set your phone away, set it away, don't text and drive. 11 new motorists out in the world with an increasing number of deaths on Maine's highways. For the entire year of 2021, 22 people died on motorcycles in Maine. We're not even in the fall yet, and 2022 has seen 25 motorcycle deaths. If you want to go ride a motorcycle, go ride. Have fun. Either ride a motorcycle or go drinking. If you're going to go drinking, go drinking, but don't add them together. Don't go drinking and get on a motorcycle. You want to go ride a motorcycle, why are you there? You want to enjoy the ride. Perkins says more people in general are on the road, which can also lead to more accidents. State of Maine, last year we did over 3,000 riders. This year, we're looking at probably 2,700 riders. Many of the riders today were first timers, but Ed Brown has been riding for decades. Uh, I've been riding since I was 15, uh, so you're talking 40 years. Brushing up on some old area. skills. Feels good to get it back. Yeah. <laughs> He's also a first responder who knows all too well the dangers that riders face. I'm a firefighter for the city of Waterville, and uh, so we, we actually see some of these, these incidents that you're talking about and it is disturbing, uh, they could be avoided. They could be avoided with uh, education uh, like this course. Helmets are not required in the state of Maine if you've been riding more than a year. Mike Perkins says it's good to still wear one. But these people here who are getting their license today, they have not, they cannot go without a helmet for a year, okay? Wear it forever. Life on the highway has its risks, but with responsible education, 11 new riders are hitting Maine's roads with confidence and a respect for the road. In Winslow, Jack Mola, New Center, Maine. The motorcycle training course is provided by KMD. Registration for courses is available until October 23rd.